Namaste. Welcome to Hem Virtues platform. There are certain built-in capabilities in each human being. And these are called self-strengths. We all possess distinct character strengths, wisdom, courage, humanity, justice, forgiveness, gratitude. These are some of such strengths that we possess in ourselves. And when a situation arises, we call for that strength which displays in the form of our own behavior. The process of identifying and utilizing your strengths in everyday life has been linked to an elevated sense of vitality and motivation. Mental strength is the capacity to deal with various stressors or challenges when they arise and still perform to the best of your ability and personal strengths. Let us see signs how we are integrating the value of self-strength. I am taking here in science a topic on acid, bases and salts. This is from grade 7. An acid is defined as a substance that has hydrogen ions and whose water solution tastes sour, turns blue litmus red and neutralizes bases. A substance is called a base when it has more of hydroxyl ions and if its aqueous solution tastes bitter, turns red litmus blue or neutralizes acids, salt is the neutral product. Salt is a neutral substance also whose aqueous solution does not affect litmus. Acids are substances that contain one or more hydrogen atoms. An acid and a base neutralize each other and form a salt. A salt may be acidic, basic or neutral in nature. If the acid is strong and the base is also strong, a neutralization act takes place completely. Neutralization plays a very important role in our life. The food that we eat, if it is acidic or alkaline, sometimes the indigestion problems we get. And that gets neutralized by having a hydroxide solution. That is basic in nature. Don't you remember the jellusil? Fruits and vegetables also are acidic and basic in nature. You know, orange contains citric acid. Balancing the strength happens, totally resulting in a stable product and water. When we correlate it with self-strength, we all have a strong mind. If we decide to, the strength of mind is part and parcel of a human being. Any force that comes in contact with a strong mind, if not controlled with the discipline or strength of character, chances are bright that the original valor or vigor or discipline may get lost in the neutralization process, self-strength then disappears just as a strong acid or a strong base get neutralized. Strength of character or self-strength needs to be 
maintained intact even on the face of adversities. However, deciding to neutralize our strength depends on us. When we yield to a much stronger negative force acting on us and if we give in, the evil force wins. The opposite is also true. When a strong negative impulse acts on us and if our self-strength is stronger, then we win. We have to be strong with positive values of wisdom, courage, adaptability, etc. And all of that and should not yield to resulting in a totally different characteristic feature. That is what acids, bases and salts teach us. Let us now try answering the MCQs and task. I'll be right back with another subject math with an interesting topic. Alright?